Benjamin Netanyahu's speech underscores a pivotal moment in history, emphasizing the clash between Iran's terror axis and the coalition of the United States, Israel, and Arab allies. He frames it as a battle between barbarism and civilization, contrasting those who glorify death with those who sanctify life. Netanyahu's vision of victory is rooted in the unity of the United States and Israel. We meet today in a crossroads of history. Our world is in upheaval. In the Middle East, Iran's axis of terror confronts America, Israel, and our Arab friends. This is not a clash of civilizations. It's a clash between barbarism and civilization. It's a clash between those who glorify death and those who sanctify life. For the forces of civilization to triumph, America and Israel must stand together. Because, because when we stand together, something very simple happens. We win, they lose. And my friends, I came to assure you today of one thing. We will win. Netanyahu's delineation of barbarism versus civilization resonates deeply with conservative values that cherish clear moral boundaries. The public often gravitates towards a black and white perception of good and evil, believing it essential for moral clarity and decisive action. The focus on the alliance between the United States and Israel reflects the conservative principle of forging strong international partnerships especially with nations sharing democratic and cultural values. Netanyahu's insistence on certain victory through unity underscores the significance of resolve and determination in achieving goals.